Hello friends, welcome to SS Unitech. My name is Sushil Singh and this is SQL Server Interview Quiz Part 4 Test Yourself. So here we have 10 questions and each question has 4 options and you will get 45 seconds to select the correct option. So before going forward, if you haven't watched part 10 of SQL Server Interview Questions and Answers video series, so I would strongly recommend to watch that video where you can understand how we can apply joins and how many number of rows will be written and this is the link and this link will be available on the description of this video so you can go and watch that video so let's start with our first question this is our question and your time starts now So time up. Option A is true because two null values are treated as a different values in SQL Server. So let's move to another question. This is our question and your time starts now. So time up. Option A is true because when null values are used in aggregate functions like sum, count, average, then null values would be skipped. So option A is true. Let's move to another question. This is your question and your time starts now. So time up. Option C is true. Here we are using self join and again two null values are treated as a different values. So option C is true. Let's move to another question. So this is your question and your time starts now. So time up. Option C is true. Here again we are using self join and null values is skipped when we used inside the aggregate functions. 
so option c is true let's move to another question this is your question and your time starts now so time up option d is true so here we are using right join so it will pick all the data from right table and we can count it would be 4 so option d is true let's move to another question this is your question and your time starts now so time up option d is true it's a cross join so all rows will be come from left table it will combine from right table so we have four rows in our left table and again we have four rows in our right table so we can multiply between 4 and 4 and we can get 16 so output would be 16 so option d is true let's move to another question This is your question and your time starts now. so time up option b is true because again two null values are treated as a different values so let's move to another question this is your question and your time starts now so time up option a is true because we cannot use on operator with cross join so option a is true let's move to another question so this is your question and your time starts now
so option b is true because when we take any column in count then it looks for null values else it return all the rows doesn't matter it has null values or not so option b is true i hope you enjoyed this quiz please leave your score on comment box if you like this video please subscribe our channel to get many more videos like this thank you so much for watching